A window is boarded up and security is stationed at the downtown CVS after Anthony Howard opened fire inside the business late Tuesday. Now police say in addition to what he did, it was what Howard said that it appears he had a target. 25 year old Anthony Howard is facing a range of charges from attempted murder to four counts of wanton endangerment. According to an arrest citation on Tuesday, Howard walked into his ex girlfriend's job around 11 at night and said she broke his heart, then shot her several times. The gunfire injured a customer who was grazed by a bullet and shattered one of the store's windows. This shooting occurred in a public place. Domestic violence impacts the entire community. It's never just between two individuals. Police say both victims are recovering, but anti-violence advocates say this instance of domestic and workplace violence is a reminder that it's senseless and preventable. One strategy is education. The Office for Women and the Center for Women and Families trains businesses on how to support domestic violence victims. If they have a protective order or a photo of their person, they can put it there. Um, they can ask for increased security. I don't know if that would have helped in this instance, but those are things that tend to help. Awareness is another tool. Advocates encourage bystanders to recognize their role in violence prevention. It can be as simple as saying something when you see something or connecting a possible abuse victim to resources. And intervening in a way that doesn't necessarily mean that you're going to jump in front of someone or, or do those kind of things that there are other pieces that you can do to support that individual. Policy is another effort. Louisville passed an ordinance giving Metro employees who are victims of abuse or other crimes paid leave. Those things allow us to be able to give survivors more resources and more access to the things that they need. Faith communities can be can play a part. Workplaces can play a part. Schools can play a part. And then, you know, just circles of, of individuals can play a part in, in increasing safety. Alexis Matthews, WOKY News. CBS issued a statement on the incident that said in part, we are shocked and saddened to learn of the shooting incident. The pharmacy is offering support to workers, including counseling services.